7 Sneaky and Dark Ways to Make Women Go Crazy for You I gave it a lot of thought before deciding to share these tips. Based on how habits and compulsions are formed, these are some powerful psychological principles. They can do a lot of damage if they fall into the wrong hands. But they can also help good men spice up their relationships with women. So, let's get started. Here are 7 dangerously good ways to make women crazy about you. 1. Go away for a little while. It's not just a sweet saying that absence makes the heart grow fonder. If you want someone to fall in love with you, it's a must. When we don't have something, we start to want it more and more. They are based on hunger and desire. If you are always there for your lover, you don't give her time to want you. More likely, she'll take you for granted. When someone or something is always around, this is what happens. But if you leave for a while, it creates a difference that lets her see how happy you make her. So, give the gift of your absence to your lover. The harder it is to be with you, the more she will want to be with you. How to do this without hurting yourself? Don't talk to your lover for a few days out of the blue. Instead, make your life so full that you can't be with her all the time. 2. Hot and cold winds. Slot machines are addicting because you never know what will happen next. If you knew when they would pay out, they would be dull. Addiction starts when you don't know what's going on. This is because dopamine is released when a person expects to feel good, not when they feel good. In the same way, women aren't as interested in you when you're always a kind and generous partner. You become the usual good guy. Women are obsessed with men who change their minds all the time. These are the guys who can be charming one night and rude and annoying the next. Addiction starts when you don't know what's going on. How to do this without hurting yourself. Don't act like a jerk on purpose to keep your partner guessing. Instead, always be true to yourself. Be completely truthful. Tell your partner what you like about something she does. Tell her if you don't like something. 3. Surprise her with unplanned moves. The most exciting thing about slot machines is that you never know when you might win the jackpot. If a woman feels that way around you, it can also lead to a strong obsession. You can build up her excitement by giving her great gifts sometimes for no reason. Want that desire to grow even stronger. Tell her the gift was a thank you for something nice she did. The next time she does something like that, don't give her a gift. This is how you teach a dog to come to you even when you don't have a treat. In the same way, you can train people to be very kind. How to do this without hurting yourself. Don't be that jerk who forgets his or her partner's birthday on purpose. Instead, be a kind person at random times of the year. 4. Try to be hard to impress. Did you have a teacher who was very strict about how grades were given? If you were a good student, you probably tried harder to show that teacher how smart you were. You probably cared more about their B plus than someone else's A because you knew it was hard to get. It works the same way between people. If you try to please everyone and act like you are impressed by everything a woman says or does, she won't respect you at all. But if you are hard to impress, she will probably try harder to win your approval. How to do this without hurting yourself. If a woman gets you, don't hold back. Instead, become a man who hangs out with interesting people and has high standards for those around him. 5. Use very emotional words. Women like to feel things. It's part of what makes them women. The more feelings you make her have, the more she will want to be with you. The best movies make you feel both happy and sad at different points in the story. Your lover wants her other relationships to be like the ones she has with you. A safe way to bring this drama back is to talk to your partner more emotionally. Pick a side and say what you think. Instead of saying you don't care what's for dinner, tell her you love sushi and hate ramen noodles. 
Tell her you love the color of her eyes or that you can't stand the way she slurps her soup. You can say these things with a smile on your face to let her know you're joking. No matter what, the emotional impact will still be felt. How to do this without hurting yourself. Don't be rude or cause trouble just because you can. Instead, make fun of the small things that don't matter by exaggerating them. 6. Create Dread It has been shown that the fear of losing something is stronger than the joy of still having it. So, the times when your partner has doubts about your relationship can fuel her obsession more than the times when she is sure about it. There are many innocent and subtle ways to plant doubt in the mind of your lover. You could Make up funny reasons why you'll never be together. You probably like to tell women that Libras aren't a good match for them. Send open-ended texts like we need to talk or I have an important question, then turn off your phone for a few hours. After she tries to text you something funny or important, put her on read. I don't like how manipulative these ideas are, but women will go crazy for you if you use them. Most people will do anything to get away from this terrible feeling of dread. How to do this without hurting yourself. Don't try to trick your partner into thinking that other women are interested in you. That is dangerous and you can see right through it. Instead, make yourself so attractive that any woman would be scared to lose you. 7. Don't give away how the movie ends. Women want their relationships to be as exciting as a Hollywood blockbuster, but this only works when the ending isn't clear. So, do her a favor and never tell her you to want to have sex with her. Of course, until the very end. It would be better to give her a good reason to come back to your place. This little bit of uncertainty makes her more interested in what might or might not happen. So she doesn't feel like a hussy for coming with you. So, in the end, it makes it more likely that you'll both be happy. How to do this without hurting yourself. When it's a win-win for both of you, you can tell white lies to build sexual tension. But don't be that guy who lies about his life or his plans just to get a girl to sleep with him. That's a selfish move that doesn't help anyone.